Solution of our differential equation, uh, first of all, uh, I am saying that what is solution? What is solution? Okay, so just think for a moment that was what is solution? And we have seen that uh, in y equal to mx plus c, we observed that d square y by dx square equal to 0. And y is equal to mx plus c dx d square y by dx square equal to 0. So, so this is, in fact, this is solution of this differential equation. This is solution of this differential equation. So simply, what is solution? What is solution? Solution to finding, to find, to find the dependent variable y. Dependent variable y. Okay, to find the dependent variable y is called solution of this uh, differential equation. And uh, this, uh, to find the dependent variable is called solution of this differential equation. Yes, in fact, this dependent variable may be some behavior. And here this behavior is what? This behavior is, this curve is a straight line. So this is a straight line. This curve is a straight line, so here the solution is this. So solution is in fact, uh, solution is in fact of two types at the moment. Okay, one is general solution. One is general solution. And the other is particular solution. So, solution is, uh, in fact, this solution is uh, a general solution. What is general solution? It contains the general constant. Uh, it contains, it contains the general constant. Contain the general constant A, B, C, etc just like y equal to mx plus c, here the general constant are m and c. So it contains the general constant m and c. And if you draw the graph of y is equal to uh, m, uh, this, so you will get a family of straight line. You will get a family of straight line. It is not one straight line. So this is y is equal to mx plus c. You know, for different m and different c, you will get different straight line. For different m and different c, you will get different straight line. So this is uh, this general solution gives you family of the curve. Okay, this is this will not give you a particular curve. So this will give you family of the curve. And what is particular solution? Sometimes we are given that. Uh, for again, I am taking this example. This is very simple example. Y equal to m x plus c. Okay, so if M is given and C is also given, okay, so you will get only one straight line if it is 2 and if it is 3. So you will get only one straight line, 2x plus 3. You will get only one particular straight line. Okay, this is equation of a line. This is one line. There is a command called plot command on which we can plot these. Uh, straight line. So this is a particular solution. Okay. So this solution is, uh, I mean, here, here uh, we are studying the application and the application give us a general solution and sometime when again application of differential equation, we get a particular solution. So it will give us a 
a solution of a particular problem. And one more thing is very important here. What is initial condition? Initial condition. In fact, these two, three are called initial condition. So the, uh, the condition at time t equal to zero is called initial condition. The condition at time t is equal to zero is called initial condition. So initial condition must be given that what is the initial condition and uh, there is another relevant terminology called boundary condition. Okay, initial condition are related with time that at different time you will get different condition. So this is called initial condition, the condition at time t equal to zero is called initial condition. The other is boundary condition, this is very relevant with the differential equation and these are uh, condition given at the boundary of the geometry. So uh, this is, uh, I mean, uh, this is just the starting, this is the main, this is the main, uh, you can say theme of this differential equation, solution of differential equation, okay? Thank you.